What is up? This is Joshua Castor. Welcome to another Ableton Live Very Quick Tip. Uh, this one's on working with drum racks. Just a quick thing I just learned, and it's so amazing that I'm still figuring stuff out inside of Ableton after working with it so many years. But um, it's, let's say I have a drum rack here, and I've got a, maybe a lot of different samples, and I want to start working with one outside side of this drum rack and um, you know you could do that you might want to do that for a number of different reasons but this is just how you do it and it's so easy you just take the uh, like snare here and you just drop it drag and drop it and it will separate it it will take it out of that drum rack see it's gone here and it will put it in this set own drum rack here and now I can work with this channel as is and if it, you don't need it in a group now uh, it's very simple you just come in right click and hit ungroup and now it's just in the sampler or simpler depending on whatever you are um, using and I think that's so dope it's just so easy to do stuff like that and that's why Ableton is my number one program anyway if you guys have any questions hit me up on Facebook and I'll see you about making a video later